Hey everyone, welcome back to Motor Travel, the motorbike channel where it's all about motorbike, travel and adventure. Today I want to talk about these motorbike intercom systems. There are a lot of complaints on the internet that the volume of these units is not loud enough. Let me tell you, nine times out of ten, it's your own fault. Don't worry, you didn't do anything wrong. It's all about your head and especially your ears. It is actually the position of your ears. Think about it, you go out and you buy yourself a motorbike helmet. How many helmets do you have to try on until you find the right one? Because our head shapes are completely different. And obviously the location of our ears on top of that is really different. When you look in the mirror, you maybe sometimes even see that one ear is further up than the other. That's just the way we are. So it all comes down where you locate the speaker in your helmet. Of course, manufacturers have an area in there where they think they should put it, but be honest, most of the time it's not the right spot. You know, think about it, you have this tiny little speaker here with very little output. I mean, you don't need more. And if that is located just, say, half an inch away from the center of your ear, there's nothing left. So what you have to do is, you have to bite the bullet, take a little bit of Velcro, and move the speaker around. Another thing you have to take into consideration, how far the speaker is actually away from your ear. So in my case, I had to completely disband the area inside the helmet where I supposed to mount it, and I had to put it on top of all the padding in a nice spot and now the speaker is very close to my ear and I have maximum volume. It's all nice and good buying that unit and letting someone in a shop fit it for you. But they don't know where your ears are located and they will definitely not take the time to make sure that the speaker is in the best position for yourself. So all you have to do is take it out, pull it out a little bit have a look, put a little bit of Velcro on it and just move it around inside your helmet and you soon find out where the sweet spot is. And that is it. So all you have to do is, for yourself, sort it out and do not blame the manufacturer because it's your fault. Actually, no, it's your head's fault. Now let's sum it all up. Don't blame the manufacturer of your helmet just because your ears are in the wrong place. Take it apart, relocate it, make sure it's close enough to your ear and really over your eardrum and you will be just fine. Maybe it needs a little bit of adaptation to it. Maybe you need a little bit of extra Velcro or a little bit of padding. But in the end, you will have the perfect solution for your intercom system. So everyone, that's me for today. I hope this demystifies this whole issue about my intercom system is not loud enough. If you like the video, please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss anything. If you are out on the road, ride safe. Until next time, bye.